What's going on guys? Today I'm going to be giving you kind of an update on the Switch Doctor build. I posted a video more in depth of, of the skills and items and stuff. I got a couple of new items and I'll quickly go over the skills in case you missed it. But if you want more depth and kind of, you know, why I chose the skills or items when I first, uh, when I first started this build, Go ahead and check out that video, and I'll put the uh, the description in the, the comment section. But I just want to go ahead and show you this, and then at the end, there's a greater rift that I'll run. And you guys can see the potential of this build, you know. So, we'll go through the skills real quick. It's a pretty simple carnival-type build. we got Poison Dart, Snake to the Face, Haunt, Poison Spirit, Piranha's Piranhado, Spirit Walk with Jaunt, Fetish Army, Legion of Daggers, Big Bag Voodoo, Slam Dance. And for the passives, we have Pierce the Veal, Grave Injustice, Fetish Psychophants, and Spirit Vessel. I was running, I believe, Tribal Rites, but I got an item, and I'll show you here in a second, to where that didn't really do me much good. So, change to this, give me a little bit more durability, and a little bit more uptime on uh, Spirit Walk. So all the gear is the exact same in the last video except for a couple pieces and I'll go ahead and show you those. Most importantly this, I happen to get this and I'm uh, really excited about it, it's pretty good you know. It could be a little bit better but it works great and it's helping a lot with the build. Really still looking for that dagger of darts, I think the dagger of darts will be better. But for now this thing is awesome and it works really well, you can keep your, your big bad voodoo just always going. So. Works great, more attack speed, more movement speed, more damage for uh, almost always. You can have this thing up all the time. So really good. And what else do we get here? Got a new ring. Um, still a Leoric Signet, but it rolled a little bit better than the last one. I've got crit chance, crit damage, both pretty good. And then I rolled the intelligence off for attack speed. Wanted a bit more attack speed. And I'm still running the Enforcer Gym. These are the same as you saw. Um, this one here is new. I didn't have an ancient. Um, same chest piece, just an ancient happened to drop, and it works pretty good. I mean, definitely could be better for an ancient. Those stats are pretty low. And I went ahead and rolled all res to it. Um, as I was getting up a little bit higher into the greater rifts, I was having having some problems staying alive. So I'm trying all res. I'm not totally sold on it. So you know, we'll see. We'll see. Well, I might roll that to something different. The shoulders are the same. And I also crafted these. 8.5 crit hit chance and 50% crit hit damage with some attack speed and intelligence with secondary, secondary resist. So I crafted those. Still working on some crafting gear. I'd really like to change this. You know, these are decent. But I'd really like to change this. Really like to find uh, like a Zephyrian amulet or something would be really awesome. But still running that. I haven't crafted this yet because I'm, well, I'm low on mats. I also happen to find Unity. I found my first Unity. So if I can find one more, it's going to make this build, I'd say, easily go into Greater Rift 40. Maybe even higher than that. But for now, I only got the one, so I'm not, not using it yet. But really excited. Hopefully another one will drop and, and really bump up the Greater Rift. So that's it for the gear. Everything else is the same. Like I said, if you want to check it out, go check out that other video. But I just want to make a quick, uh, kind of like an update how the Witch Doctor is going. And show you guys, you know, the, its potential. We're still using the same same build. A little bit different on the skills, uh, you know, for, for the different gear. But pretty much the same thing. And really cool. So anyways, I'll go ahead and turn off the mic and let you watch the video of I believe it's greater rift 35 I really think that we can push higher than 35 I just haven't gotten very lucky with um, a decent greater rift you know it's always really tight and kinda running into some low density but I think even with this without the unity and all of that I really think that that I can do 36 pretty easy probably even 37 so anyways hope you guys enjoy the video and don't forget to leave a like and subscribe
there you guys go pretty cool build I like it a lot and I hope you guys like it too um, I did speed up the greater rift to one and a half times up until the boss fight the boss fights actual speed so you guys can see it's it's boss clearing um, efficiency I guess but anyways hope you guys liked it thanks a lot for watching Thanks for watching guys. If you liked, please leave a like and don't forget to subscribe. Catch you later.